This is just a little segment about bee vacuums. This will be really quick. Basically, I was talking to somebody who had one of their colonies absconded and they could see them, but they were on a fence and they didn't know how to capture them. If they land on a tree or a branch, it's pretty simple. You just shake the, the branch and they just they into a box and it makes it really simple. If they're on a fence or some other odd object on a car, maybe it makes it way more difficult. What I have on hand is I have a bee vacuum that I've made myself. When all was said and done, I think we're like $30 in on this. You can buy these online, pre-made in nice boxes and stuff like that. I've just found that all of my bee supplies get dirty and they get gross. And why spend a lot of money on something that's really nice? Because it's not going to stay nice. So I went with a bucket and I'll just walk through and show you how I made it. Honestly, from, from start to finish, I think it was probably an hour. This is the bucket head. Um, I got this from Home Depot. This is like the simplest way to do this. You take a five gallon bucket, you take these, and just snap it onto any five gallon bucket. Now if you do it just like this with a bucket without any holes, you're gonna kill a bunch of bees, okay? You drill four holes in it. You take a screen, and you cover each one of these holes. Very simple. Um, I glued them in place uh, with with a uh, hot glue gun, and it's it's held really well. I hooked up the vacuum to it, and I checked the suction on it. You wanted to have suction, but not a lot. And basically, what it came down to for us is we left one of these completely uncovered, and the other three holes are completely covered. And it gives enough suction that you'll. You'll have to get right next to them, um, and it sucks them up into that. And here is our vacuum in action. You can just see that it doesn't really have too much suction. And then when you're done, that is this is what it looks bees. like inside. Tons of bees, and if you do the suction at the right amount, you'll be okay.